Okay, um, I think this is the recording, and I am at uh, September, the beginning of September, uh, through to the end of October. And I have twice as many uh, photos um, and twice as many outfits because it includes um, some of my ski season and my fall outfits. And um, it's, uh, I get out, the colder the weather gets, the, the more I can get out because of the Parkinsonism. That's just the way my brain functions. And I still can't climb very much, but I was able to do a lot more than 10 minutes. I got up to 30 minutes uh, climbing uh, the one larger hill at, um, at, at Moonlight Beach here in Sudbury. And the other thing that I want you to know is that if you can find a friend, I have a friend who has a friend, and they isolate together. In other words, they don't live together, but they isolate together. And they have been able to shop together and go places and, and go outside and enjoy uh, life despite the COVID restrictions. And I am lucky that I'm in Northern Ontario and people here have been pretty much sane and much saner than Toronto, Ottawa, Montreal, Quebec, and I won't even go where the United States is going. That is absolutely maniacal. They're just killing 100,000 people a day and they're completely out of their out of their minds. And they're making a disease political, which is really stupid. This is a killer. And anybody who doesn't wear a gas mask it has to be considered to be a murderer. It is just that stupid. And the only reason people are voting for Trump is because they finally made money and they're going to have lower taxes. But they don't care about humanitarian. They don't care about humanity. They don't care about poisoning children. They don't care about anything. And that is really the bottom line. And I just can't say enough about how stupid it is because the COVID mask, we're going to be looking at this for at least five years, people. Um, and it can be 100%. Uh, again, I've, I've said that a thousand times. Water resistant and uh, nylon, 100% nylon, super stretch. Uh, yeah, and you double it and you put inside the furnace filter, which is a MERV 11. And uh, I'm going to turn this down. This is uh, my Samba music. It just makes me feel good. Okay, and um, what we have here is now the leaves were turning and I got to walk up one little hill. I've been able to do that since ski season in March. And uh, that's my sweetest friend, the dearest person on the planet, Helen, who has rescued me a couple of times and has the heart of, of pure diamond, platinum. She is an amazing person. And uh, these are my uh, new outfits. Now, what you will see here is Dan is now wearing ski clothes, and I'm still wearing what you people might consider uh, spring, summer, and fall. But uh, once it gets to be around zero, um, I don't need to wear a jacket. I like the cold. makes me feel good. So that's his mask, as you can see, and it's doubled with the Merv 11. Uh, he's got it in his pocket. He carries it with him. And uh, these are most of my new outfits that cover my large tumor on my leg that can't be operated on. And I made matching masks that goes over my gas mask. And um, this is one of my favorites. Um, the yellow's okay, but I like my red as well. That's my red. I love that outfit. Um, I'll be wearing that more in ski season. And the same with my sea green. This is the sea green. I'll be wearing that in ski season. Uh, more of these, this is, see this is, I'll be wearing it in ski season. And, uh, that's my little furry fake fur that I made. That's also in ski season. Um, because now it was like five and eight below, getting colder. But I still didn't get any snow. Fiddle-dee-dee. 
fiddle-doo-dum. I like snow. And uh, <laughs> yeah, poor Dan, he's all covered up. I only covered up in the rain. Um, that's my rain gear. Yeah, it was raining and we had a little bit of light snow that day. Um, that's now, we're into towards the end of October. And I'm getting ready for my ski season. My Jeep is gone for its uh, snow tires. And um, I'll be walking a lot more. But I'm going to be loading up my skis pretty soon. And uh, that's my copper outfit. That's also a ski outfit. Um, yeah. And uh, what have we got here? Yeah, this is copper. That's 100% not breathable. I didn't make the mask to go with that. Uh, Dan's got dozens of beautiful ski jackets and he won't wear them. <laughs> he wears this leather that I bought him. And that's, again, that's a rain outfit and ski outfit, but more for really wet snow and rain. Um, and uh, that was, I was headed to the dentist. I was not happy. <laughs> and there I was so happy I got snow. And there's my Jeep. We were taking it, getting it ready for the, for the winter. Get it winterized. And uh, this is the last of my fall outfits. Because from here on end, the next video, that's my spiffy one that I love. That's actually a ski outfit as well. That's my red rain gear that I wear. And that's me. Yep.